place that remembers Caiaphas's house and or palace, this is the place that Jesus would have been brought to after he was arrested in the Garden of Gethsemane. And I'm going to show you how far that is because it's not very far at all. So behind me, you will see the Garden of Gethsemane right over here at the corner of where the uh, Temple Mount is. And it's only a short walk down the Kidron Valley and back up into what now is known as the area of Zion. This is where the rich people lived. And so uh, this is where Caiaphas who was kind of a co-high priest. He was one of the rich people. So you can see I this house is way up on a hill and Jesus would have been brought here. And there's probably an emergency meeting of the Sanhedrin, which was the ruling is, uh, leaders of religious leaders of Jesus' day. And Peter, who said he'd never deny Jesus, followed them as they arrested him and brought him to Caiaphas' house. He was inside this courtyard, outside the house. And it is in this courtyard that Peter didn't deny him once or twice but three times in the same night after just a few hours earlier at the Last Supper saying, though all people turn from you, I will never deny you. I will go die with you. And here only a few hours later, he already denied even knowing him three times. And so uh, this is just a great example of the fact that Jesus now left totally alone. All his best friends have, have deserted him and his last best friend denied him. At the very end, Jesus is by himself. Uh, in a dungeon inside of this house, being illegally held, illegally uh, gone through a trial, being abused. And the guy that should be standing up for him is literally standing where I'm standing, saying I don't even know him. And today, there's a statue that remembers that time in Peter's life where you've got the centurion and you've got the two young ladies that uh, met him at the fire. And uh, he denies Jesus th these three times. So. Um, what a horrible moment in Peter's life where he realizes, man, I've failed the greatest man in history, my teacher, my rabbi, and uh, my best friend. And uh, though it's heartbreaking, uh, on the other side there's going to be redemption, although he doesn't know it now.